House of Horrors Nightmare. What do you need to do if you get abducted? Hey, back up! The chilling details of the Cleveland kidnapping ordeal are a reminder that you must always be vigilant about your personal safety. But what should you do if you found yourself being abducted? We've got some information we hope you never need to use. Could Ariel Castro's teenage victims have done anything to keep themselves out of his clutches? Safety expert Steve Cardian showed me how to combat a potential kidnapper with the help of 17-year-old volunteer Beth McCaffrey. What can a woman do? Uh, what she can do, if I go to grab her and drag her, she'll base out, drop back her hips off. to the ground, kick, 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 yell for me to back off, get up, and she'll run. Why is it imperative for her to fight off the attacker at the first location? If she's taken from the primary crime scene to the secondary location, Location, and it's a stranger, she's not going to be coming back. It's a 95% chance that we won't ever see her again. But once a kidnapper has you inside his lair, like the Cleveland House of Horrors, the rules change. If you have been abducted, you want to try and personalize yourself, try and develop a relationship with this person on short notice so that you're not looked at like an object, like a thing. You want to become a person. Ariel Castro's victim stayed alive by being compliant, but Steve Cardian advises always be on the lookout for that one chance to escape. Always look for somehow to, to escape. Never give up that, that avenue. Alicia Kosakevich knows the ordeal the Cleveland kidnap victims have been through. She was abducted by a sex predator in 2002 and held in his house in Virginia. I did whatever I could to survive, no matter how humiliating or awful it was because I knew that I needed to stay alive as long as possible for somebody to find me. Fortunately, she was rescued by the FBI after four days of help. She has this advice for the victims in Cleveland. If I could see them, I would just really, I would want to give them a hug and tell them that there may be some really hard days ahead for them, but it will get better. The next in edition.